Hello. Today's topic is condition for resolution of a quadratic function into linear factors. First, we state a theorem and then we try to prove it to find the condition for resolution of a quadratic function into linear factors. So the theorem is the quadratic function ax square plus 2hxy plus by square plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c is resolvable into linear rational factors linear rational factors if and only if a b c plus 2 f g h minus a f square minus b g square minus c h square is equals to 0 that is a h g h b f g f c is equals to 0 okay now we try to prove this theorem the equation corresponding to the given quadratic function is a x square plus 2hxy plus py square plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c equals to 0. Okay. So this implies ax square plus 2xhy plus g plus by square plus 2fy plus c equals to 0. Therefore, we get a quadratic equation for x. Then solving for x, we get x is equals to minus 2 into hy plus g plus minus root over 4 into hy plus g whole square minus 4a multiplied by by square plus 2fy plus c whole divided by 2a where a is not equals to 0. Okay. Now the given expression will have linear rational factors. The given expression will have linear rational factors only if the values of x are rational linear expression in y. The values of x are rational linear expression in y. And this is possible only when the roots of the above equation are real and equal. This is possible only when the roots of the above equation are 
are real and equal. Okay, so that is the discriminant is equals to zero. Therefore, you can write that 4 into hy plus g whole square minus 4a multiplied by b y square plus 2fy plus c is equals to 0. And this implies y square multiplied by a square minus ab plus 2 into h g minus a f multiplied by y plus g square minus a c is equals to 0. Therefore, we get a quadratic equation in terms of y and the roots of this equation are equal if and the roots of the equation this equation are equal if discriminant is equals to 0. Therefore, we get 4 multiplied by hg minus af whole square minus 4 into h square minus ab multiplied by g square minus ac is equals to 0. And this implies abc plus 2fgh minus a f square minus b g square minus c e square is equals to 0. So, this is the required condition. Okay. Now, we do a sum to understand this concept more clearly. The values of m for which the expression 2x square plus mxy plus 3y square minus 5y minus 2 can be expressed as the product of two linear factors. Can be expressed as the product of two linear factors. So, we need the values of m for which the expression can be expressed as the product of two linear factors. So, start this solution. Comparing the given equation with ax square plus 2hxy plus by square plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c is equals to 0, that is the required condition, is going to be after uh, putting the values of a, H, B, C, F and G, we get A equals to 2, H is equals to M by 2, B is equals to 3, C is equals to minus 2, F equals to minus 5 by 2 and G is equals to 0. These values, that is the values of A, H, B, C, F and G, we get comparing this and this equation and after putting this value into the required condition, that is A, B, C plus 2, F, G, H minus A, F square minus B, G square minus C, H square equals to 0 we get minus 12 minus 25 by 2 
plus 2 into m square divided by 4 is equals to 0 and this implies m square is equals to 49 therefore m is equals to plus minus 7 so the required value of m is plus minus 7 so that's all for today thank you very much